you know, supercharged setups, turbo setups. I, me personally, I prefer more of a more of a car, so less electronics. Take it back to basics, naturally aspirated. I switched up the suspension. That we put uh, sport springs on it. Dropped it by a couple of inches, not too low. I quite like that sort of Euro stance, sort of flush look. Switch the alloys like all petrol heads do. I think we're on. I think I'm rolling on sevens at the moment. One uh, nineteens at the back, um, just for that grip. There's only one sort of group of guys that I take it to, who are local, who you know really do a good job, and they know they know what I like. They know how the car should be treated with respect, and they really know how to take care of her. Recently made the addition of a limited slip diff at the back, which has really helped to not only get the back end out a little bit more, I'm quite a good driver as it is, I do a lot of track days, and uh, so I'm fairly capable of getting the back end out as it is, but this just allows us to put more power through, um, really plant it down and just like, you know, leave those two 11s that most petrol heads are trying to put down anyway. People look at the car, uh, it is special. Um, you don't see them a lot, and uh, you know, guys are taking pictures, standing in front of it, kids all the way up to grandparents, you know, they want to sit in it, they want to take pictures with it, they want to talk to you. Uh, it gets a lot of attention. I mean, I've done, I've done a little bit of off-roading in it as well. I try not to take it out because I don't want to get it too dirty, but, I mean, she's just so capable of everything. I mean, I've had the odd sort of, you know, incident where I've sort of, you know, a lot of body roll. Occasionally she, she tumbles over, but we get her up, dust her off, and, you know, get back on. And she just, you know, so well composed and just handles it like a dream. Uh, I like to sort of get home after a long day, put her up on a jack and just, you know, go to work and just forget about everything, you know, really get into the zone and, like I said, there's something about just working on your own car that helps me just kind of, you know, feel it's really cathartic just to sort of sit down in peace and quiet and just get to work. I mean, you know, people might think I'm crazy that, you know, I spend so much time with the car. Yeah, I'm sure they will, but that's because they don't, they don't understand the passion, they don't know what it's, you know, what it's like to truly love cars.